The year is 1649. John Lilburn is on trial for high treason. Now, his nickname is Freeborn John, so you already know this guy is one of our champions of liberty. He's head of the levelers. He's a tremendously popular person uh, among all the English. And when he's on trial, he boldly asserts the right that the jury has to decide not only facts, but about the law as well. They can find someone not guilty if they feel that the law is unjust or it's being unjustly applied in his circumstance. And he makes this bold claim and it only takes the jury 45 minutes to agree with him. See, the levelers felt that political power is truly derived from the people. And they had these radical notions like uh, trials should be held in the native language. So it should be held in English so the jury and the defendant understand what's being said. And any phrases in Latin or French would have to be translated so that it's more than just the prosecution and the judge who understands what's going on. So it's at this moment in time where our notions of jury nullification truly begin. 